Welcome back guys, I am Muni from smarttutorials.net This is a series of tutorials on how to integrate jQuery autocomplete with the Laravel cake PHP and coordinator Please check the video description for the demo or download link This is continuation on how to integrate jQuery autocomplete with the cake page framework In previous tutorial we seen how to in, uh, install cake page facing composer Also downloaded the dependency for the jQuery autocomplete jQuery and jQuery UI For styling purpose we downloaded in, uh, bootstrap as well So we kept uh, CSS and JSS in JS, webroot CSS and JS folders Next I am opening the project in Visual Studio Code Um, next, create the employees controller in SRC controllers folder. Employees controller dot PHP. Inside the employees controller, I am adding uh, index method. In so each public method in the controller becomes the page of the application. Okay. Now to access this particular page, uh, go to the browser and uh, the controller name and method name okay by default cake which we expect in the template file inside the uh, we are able to see that template content displayed here okay by default cake uh, uses its own uh, default layout so but i want to use the different styles so i'm planning to create uh, a different layout so I'm not I'm gonna I'm not I will not touch the default layout so I create the new layout so to create new layout go to the SRC and uh, SRC templates and under the layout folder create the new CTP file I'm creating app.ctp okay just copy the content of the default layout so CTP and paste it here and remove the default styles and this navigation everything uh, next just include uh, load the css we have downloaded from previous tutorial like jquery post up everything using uh, html helper method css okay using C html helper css method in i'm passing array of uh, file names that we have put in the webroot css folders okay just pause the, so autom it automatically uh, kphp will automatically load the files from webroot css folder also i'm planning to create the app.css where i am writing custom css for this application okay so we have successfully load so uh, successfully uh, loaded the css file next i'm planning to load the script uh, jquery and jquery i mean everything we have downloaded right so using html script method you can load this um, the scripts we have downloaded added to the pre in previous tutorial jquery and jquery i most of everything we are loaded now okay so we almost we successfully created uh, the custom layout so to check that add some text okay <laughs> the custom layout yeah, by by default, uh, we are not specified to use the KPHP to use the custom layout, right? So we must specify uh, the KPHP to use the custom layout. So in order to specify uh, the KPHP, KPHP to use the custom layout in the controller index method, say I want to use this custom layout that I have created. Uh, so now reload. Yeah, see that it uses custom layout. So, so I just I'm using Bootstrap for styling, right? So, um, from the Bootstrap example, I we are not specify base path, so I'm just removing the base path as of now. Okay, just now reload. Yeah, see we have added the navigations but keeping this HTML snippet is not uh, it's not good because um, i'm planning to use the some uh, cake pitch element uh, i create the new cake pitch element and put it this 
estimates neighbor snippet to in the HTML in the element capture so I create neighbor.ctp and put it I put it here okay so now I load this um, navbar into the CDP yeah that's working fine okay um, so <clears throat> so uh, planning to implement the simple jQuery autocomplete and uh, multi uh, text field autocomplete uh, autocomplete right so it requires the two pages so I'm planning to add two more public method inside so just I'm renaming it single multi to so next I'm I need to add the template file to these two pages so inside that okay to access this single and multi provide the controller name and the method name okay single yeah and multi yeah variable to access but um, I want to display the employees employees controller index method when when we try to access K auto when you enter the uh, root URL receptor I want to display the employees controller index method so in to achieve that we need to um, re rewrite the routing okay go to the config folder and open routes.php by default uh, the root url points to the pages controller and display action so i am just commenting out all the routing that by default comes with the okay php uh, employees controller index method so i am just telling when user enters the goes to the root url of the site just display the employees controller index action now see yeah now reload yeah we actually achieved it also when someone clicks on um, auto and single jQuery autocomplete cake php i want to display the single uh, employees control single action okay so for that i'm just when users enters uh, jquery autocomplete cake php uh, i want to point the single action okay yeah we actually did next uh, when someone enters multi text field auto completion okay just implies controller multi m u l t okay yeah we actually uh, we almost achieved what we want so in this tutorial we have created controller added layout and uh, added new custom layout and created pages three pages and everything next tutorial we're gonna implement simple jQuery auto complete in cake php so uh, let's meet you guys in next tutorial please subscribe and press the bell icon to get the updates immediately thanks for watching